Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Plug Talk. My name is Adam22. I am joined here by my lovely wife, Lena the Plug. Hi everyone. And today we're going to be sitting down and having a conversation with a truly delightful starlet that I'm sure you guys are all going to really enjoy. Oh my gosh. Summer <laughs> Cole is in the building. How are you doing today? I'm doing great. Thank you. A little bit nervous. <laughs> Why are you so nervous? Let's talk this about this. This is my first podcast after like a year and a half. <laughs> right. Because you had a somewhat traumatic episode yes. on another podcast. Can we just talk about that before we get into this? Well, it is like they asked for my body count, you know? Okay. And somebody in the comments say like, oh my gosh, a girl that has to sleep with 300 guys, like she has to have something. Right. And, I, and this podcast he's living is like interviewing stars. So right. he knows we get tests constantly, mostly the civilian. And he say, oh no, that's right, probably. That was his comment. I was like, he didn't even say anything or maybe not replying, like, but he replied that comment and he said, well, that's right. She probably has something. It is weird <laughs> to invite on a certain type of guest and then just like diss them in but the comments. But you're saying that the comments, so the interview was good, but then yeah. in the comments, somebody said something mean and he commented back and didn't refute it enough? Yes, exactly. She just said, that's right. She has something. Interesting. I was like, yeah. Dude. that's kind of odd because like I, i'm always very mindful of that is yeah. that i don't want to like heart comments on youtube we mm -hmm. comment we heart a lot of comments here on youtube but i don't want to do it if it's like even if it's really really positive like sometimes i'll heart a comment and it'll say like adam you are the fucking best uh -huh. you're so much better than blank and then i'll have to unheart it because i don't want to be liking a comment that says you're so much better than somebody yeah. else because then it's like i'm directly exactly. and it shows up her. higher in yeah. the yeah. algorithm but that comment really touched me because they say oh she's dirty and they say yeah she is basically that's what it, you know and i was like you most that anyone knows that we get tests right yeah well, let me tell you this <laughs> you could have five thousand bodies and lena and i will respect you just the same <laughs> Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Thank you so much. You have my vote. Yeah. Okay, good. I, I like you that. You can also fuck 5,000 people <laughs> and not have an STD. Yes. Which people don't really believe. 5,000, though. But if you get tested and you fuck older yes. people while they're tested. Oh, we yeah. Well, that's like saying you could run a million miles and never get a, a sore ankle. <laughs> you could catch something, but it doesn't mean you have like a permanent no, STD yeah, that yeah. never yeah. leaves your body. But I'm saying, like, to me, I consider STDs just kind of part of the game. It's like being a skateboarder and never okay. sk skimming no. your, your no, knee against the ground. No, something that, you know, like really bad. But STD, oh, yeah, yeah. If AIDS you get tests yeah. and you treat them, you're fine. You know? Adam no, yeah. in 2016, 2017 told me he doesn't believe in STDs because he never had one. And then I got a bunch <laughs> from you. Yeah. <laughs> we got like two or three together. Mm hmm. Yeah. But the more people you fuck, yeah. Yeah, the more people you fuck. I actually think every STD I've ever gotten in my entire life has been with mm -hmm. Lena. Because I never had one before you. And then we collectively got them from a if couple different shapes. If you got them without me, I'd be really like, what the fuck did you do without me? Well, I'd be <laughs> probably having sex with someone. But yeah, like I, I didn't get any before <laughs> oh you. And I've only yes. gotten them with you since. Which I, yes. I like that we've always We're bonding. had a team vibe going exactly. right there. Exactly. You got something, you got it too. Get that's tested, yeah. guys. Get tested. Yes, that's you the fucking best thing get you can tested. do. That's the best thing you can do. <laughs> so I noticed that you have this uh, sexy little fresh off the boat accent. Can we talk yeah. about exactly that what rude? that is? Is it? Oh, no. no. It's, it's, everybody say I like it. A lot of people come like here on a boat. Okay, that. I'm not the so, boat thing. So where are you from? <laughs> I am from Colombia. Okay. Yeah, so I lived my whole life born and raised, and I came here to U.S. three years ago. Okay, and what what was the upbringing in Colombia like? Uh, work, money. Money? <laughs> that your upbringing <laughs> was working? Yeah, from Where? like age one, you were working? Um, before I was a nanny, uh, living in nanny. And then I decided to quit that and doing porn. Okay. So you lived with the parents? The parents. Okay. Yeah. How was that? Oh, awful. <laughs> really? Why? You work like 12 hours. Yeah, you're on call. You all get paid, you get paid like shit of money. I used to get paid $200 a week. Wow. wow. 